Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it's time for Into the Car Driving Too Much Cubby! Hello, welcome. What is it, Wednesday? Ooh, what a week. I hope it's winding down, the, the year is winding down for you. Um, this still this week is still a little hyped, a little hype for me. I, th- I felt like Monday, it really started to feel like it was winding down. Not so much, not so much today, not so much all this week or Saturday. Uh, anyway, I hope today that you were out there listening to this, watching this, however have you. There's a helicopter above us. Anyway, I hope that helicopter is looking down on you while you're riding a horse. Today is the day of the horse. Sometimes the horse gets a whole year. Today is its day, though, in which it is celebrated and you need to go ride a horse. Now, it is a very short list today of the days, as it were. And you would think that, you know, maybe we're gearing up for some major holidays. Like, this is the lull period before the major stuff all happens. You might also be worried that there isn't a food on this list. And to you, I would say, I did just say horse, right? It's the day of the horse. But no, perhaps you should celebrate today with the food of Coco. It is Coco Day. Uh, I think Coco is almost, uh, at least, we're almost at the every other day, I think, point of Coco in our house. Uh, a festive staple, as it were. Uh, my daughter's choice of how to make cocoa is literally just warm milk up, put a little bit of uh, chocolate, the powdery stuff in, and marshmallows. It's more about the marshmallows than it's anything else. Um, I do prefer... Um, I think this is more of a me just admitting that I don't make great coffee drinks, but I do make coffee drinks that I enjoy. And oh wow, I'm gonna admit all the way how I make this. But okay, so I have my espresso machine, right? I make essentially a quad shot of espresso. I do the steamed milk, but within the steam milk, and you know it's gonna mess up the steamer eventually here. It, you have to clean it a lot after the fact. If, you, if you're familiar with the steamer, and how espresso machines work. There's a lot going into it, and you really got to clean that spout. Especially if in the steamed milk, you put like a whole bag of the cocoa powder and cake frosting. I put cake frosting into the milk with the cocoa powder, mix it all up, and once it starts heating, I'm still mixing it while it's steaming to make sure that everything and what happens is there's essentially this this first layer film that kind of forms I think because of the sugar heating up but you keep that mixing down into the hot liquid and it all eventually kind of just comes out like normal frothy milk at the end but it's a very sweet chocolatey frothy milk and you know that that's just slowly ruining my steamer but once the drink is all the way assembled it is very good I hope I'm still recording and my phone is doing weird stuff. Uh, it's, it's a good drink. I don't know if Starbucks is out there just putting cake frosting into their uh, their drinks, but it's probably pretty close, right? The chocolate syrups and the, the flavor sauces and all those stuff that they're putting into it can't be that different. So there's the secret recipe of how Braden is making coffee. Man, I don't have any more cake frosting to do this. This was literally just like a leftover bag. And I'm like, that's something sweet I can melt, I think, into coffee. And it was delicious. So uh, there's a secret, everyone. Go out and melt cake frosting into your 
sweet cappuccino, frappuccino-like drinks. And last but not least, the third one, the last one of the days of today. Today is Violin Day. So I, you know, perhaps I tell you something very sad, or very not really sad, but I'm looking for sympathy anyway, and you go out and just play the world's tiniest violin playing Hearts and Flowers. Is that what the, what the saying is? The world's tiniest violin playing Hearts and Flowers? Yeah. But hopefully you don't have to do that, and you just go out and celebrate and play an amazing piece on the violin today while riding your horse, drinking hot cocoa, cocoa one hand, violin the other, and riding a horse. That That's quite the sight. Also, the arch. Ah. Well, I hope you're happy. I hope you're healthy. I hope you're driving safely. We'll catch you on the flip side. Goodbye, everybody.